Hello and welcome to the Minutes Within the Mist, where we wander the darker forests to bring you tales of cryptids, ghosts, and other mysteries. Today, we meet a pair of girls who just might prove that reincarnation is real. We will meet the Pollock sisters. On May 5th of 1957, 11-year-old Jacqueline and 6-year-old Joanna Pollock were hit by a car while walking to church with a friend in the small town of Hexham, England. They were killed instantly. Their parents, John and Florence, were devastated and wanted nothing more than to have their daughters back in their arms. John even declared that they would have another set of girls soon, but no one believed him. However, just as if he had willed it, Florence gave birth to a set of twin girls one year later, which they named Jillian and Jennifer. John felt that their deceased daughters had come to be reborn despite his Catholic faith. Not surprisingly, his wife was a bit skeptical, but they both noticed rather unmistakable signs that their prayers had indeed been answered. It was as though the girls did more than just resemble their departed sisters. Jennifer had a distinct white line across her forehead in the exact same spot that Jacqueline had a scar. She also had the same birthmark as Jacqueline. Over time, the parents grew more and more convinced that the twins Jennifer and Jillian were reincarnations of Jacqueline and Joanna. The family had moved to Whitley Bay when the two girls were just babies. Then, at age four, when they returned to Hexham, Jennifer and Jillian were able to point out landmarks that the deceased Jacqueline and Joanna had been familiar with, such as the school that they had formerly attended. They even seemed to know the way to the playground that their deceased sisters used to love to go to, even without ever having seen it. Although Florence had stored the late girl's toys out of sight, the twins started to ask for certain toys back. In fact, it was almost as if the twins remembered the toys as their own, supporting that they were the deceased daughters brought back to life. Through the years, the two girls began to forget their former lives. However, their parents remained convinced that their lost daughters did return to them. I hope you enjoyed these minutes with the Pollock sisters. Join us at the Within the Mist podcast for more cryptids, ghosts, and other mysteries. But until then, keep your eyes open and remain constantly curious.